So what is going on YouTube? Tough stuff here, aka Bluetooth Master. <laughs> You're right. Anyway, today's video is about how to pair the Planetronics Legend Bluetooth device, and if it looks just like this, that's exactly what you're going to be pairing. So, to get things started, let's talk about some of the buttons quickly. Go over them. Um, as always, the universal on and off button, which is right there, and you'll notice the little symbol thing that goes right there. That's the on and off button. Uh, the volume control is over here. And then there's the talk button over here. Um, yeah, there's another button there. Not too sure exactly what it does, but it does something. So, we're going to go ahead and pair it with the Samsung Note 3. And basically, the, they have similar capabilities, just like the uh, Note 4 and 5. And how do I know? Because I have them. What? But anyways, um, so in order to pair this thing, we want to go straight to the settings section. You can use a drop-down menu if you want to. That's totally up to you. But I always like to do it right from the start, head-on into the settings section. Yeah just to make sure everything's under control. So we're going to go to Bluetooth where it says connections to the top under the settings area, Bluetooth, and I'm going to get a tab of that. And of course, you can see it's currently off. I'm going to hit on. And um, before you hit scan, make sure you um, tap to make visible to other devices. This is usually not recommended, but for the sake of Bluetooth, let's just tap it to have them on. Don't hit scan yet until you turn it on. No, actually, you're going to turn, you're going to hit scan, okay? Because this is not like the iPhones where they scan automatically. So you're going to hit scan, and as soon as you do that, rest your phone, and um, you're going to turn it on. You see the on button again? We're going to turn it on, and while you, after you turn it on, make sure you hold this button over here, okay? That's the one the closest to the earbud, okay? that button you're gonna press it down until the light goes blue red blue red blue red that means try it here okay so go ahead and hit scan on your phone okay and tap scan I think that usually lasts for about uh, a minute I think so we're gonna turn it on and simultaneously hold down the um, power the um the top button okay so go ahead and turn it on notice the blue light is on you can just of course the on button is just an on button just flip it up and then pay attention to the light, you'll notice it start uh, changing colors. Once that's happening, that means it's in pairing mode, and you can look down. Again, scan if your scan stop. Oops. Oh my god, are you so, so serious with this right now? Um, yeah, just go ahead and hit scan again. And it's still blinking, okay? Once the, the blue-red light, you can let go of the button. Okay, when the blue-red light starts flashing alternately, just changing blue red blue red blue red you can let go the the top button okay because it's in constant pairing mode okay notice that and as you can see it showed up right there so you can get and tap that and it's going to pair it automatically for you okay and it's going to ask you if you want to um have your contacts and all that stuff connected so once you have it on like if you um whatever you name your contact so if it's like joey and you can say call from joey or you can come and call from joey whatever it says right right okay so i'm not gonna do that because this is not really mine but yeah, but once that's on it's blue text, that means it's connected. So that's it. You can go back to the home button or whatever. Do what you got to do. Peace out. If this was helpful, let me know. And that will be it.